As a pretty lazy Genshin player, I never use any of my fragile resins to farm besides the normal amount of resins we get every day. This results in a lot of my characters being under leveled and abandoned at level 1. But I'm gonna change it all today. I'll be spending 10,000 resins to build my characters and farm artifacts to upgrade them. And eventually you attempt to beat the Spiral Abyss by the end of it. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, this account is also free to play to the extreme. Meaning I had not wished on this account besides doing one temple on the beginner's banner for Noel. So let's see if 10,000 resins is enough for me to clear the Abyss on this account. So, uh, I'm trying to spend 10k resin to fix my Road to 100k account, and this account is completely free to play. No spending any primo gems as well. I didn't well, I didn't spend anything, so I'm clean. I do have a lot of resins, so I have 6k resins right now I could spend. So, these are all my characters right now that I have. I do have Layla that I got from an earlier event that's level 1 still. So I'll be trying to focus on building her today. I do have Jean, but she's not going to get built yet since I kind of pulled her on accident. Since I did one temple on a beginner spanner to get Noelle. And she kind of joined with her. So so my focus right now is to level up all my characters to level 90. Later, I think she has some artifacts right now. But I might need more. Like these tenacity artifacts are good, but maybe not as good as I want them to be. So I'll definitely try to find more. Hopefully. Also, I, I have a lot of weapons I need to farm as well. So yeah. Can't need to farm all of these. Some of these weapons I don't think are possible for me to farm today. So it'll probably be better if I do it on Sunday, technically, but oh well. Yeah, I'm farming for Layla and also trying to improve on my other characters. So maybe Noel, Triple Crown, if I can. Um, Layla, maybe Triple Crown as well. And just the rest of my characters as well in general. Like some of these resins I can't, like domains I can't farm yet. Yeah. Definitely a lot of improvements I could have. Maybe I can farm this. Oh yeah, I can farm this actually. Okay. I guess this will be the first domain that we go into. So I'll probably use a Kaya comp and maybe a Hyper Broom comp in general since I believe this domain is Hydro. Let me create a new team. Can I do it? Yeah. This will be my domain farming team. Kaya is good. Okay, so at least my Lisa can destroy the shield decently fast right now. No. This domain also has bubbles, which is pretty annoying. All right, just give me some gold. I feel like I'm pretty lucky. Gold? Uh, never mind. Please. Not bad. Even though it only took me 1 minute and 30 seconds on all of the runs, around average. Oh, pretty good drops now. Okay, so the weapon we're looking to upgrade is this one. And since there's an event right now, we'll be able to get double the EXP, or like 1.5. So it's a pretty good time to level the weapon up. Okay, nine more of this and two more of these, but I'm pretty sure I can just craft them, so I have all the materials needed. Okay, got my weapon to level 90. Now what? Wait, let me check. Is this weapon using the same... Oh, it is actually. Hopefully I have enough after this. Okay, can I craft three right now? Let me check. Wow, perfect. With that five condensed resin spent, I was able to get both weapons to level 90 now. I mean, I'll level her up first, I guess. Artifact-wise, I'm just gonna give her random stuff for now. Good enough. Where am I going again? Okay, I need to pick up the Lotus, I believe. I'm taking my Layla out for a walk, though, because she actually needs some... some levels. And I'm also leveling up the characters passively. Okay, I found them. Layla, please, just level up. I mean, the thing is, I do have, uh, like, enough green books to level up my character. Like, look. I can ascend a character right now, right? Pretty cool. But I just like to leave my characters there. I don't know how, how strong my Layla shield is. See, like even at level 40? Level 49? Oh, never mind. I was about to say my shield isn't getting broken, but it just got broken. You know what? I'm being a normal person and just leveling my characters up this way. Wow, she has exactly 1k attack right now. What if I just stop over here? If I ascend it, will I ruin my perfect attack stack? Yeah, I'll, I'll get 9 attack, which will ruin the 1000. But I also get more HP though, so I think it's worth it. Okay, time to farm her talents though. I believe I need more. This thing is today, right? Okay, it is. Eh, I'll just go into talent domain first. Okay, that one is uh, just gliding there. Come down! We have cookies. Come on! Okay, good enough. Well, I scammed you. I don't have cookies, but I have, like, pain for you, I guess. Does anyone know how fast they can clear this domain? I don't know if you ever time yourself, but, like, I clear this domain in less than one minute. Ooh, I need more of these cursed scrolls. 
I don't see how far I can get my talents up. Okay, so level eight is the max right now for me. But let me craft more. They have like a thousand of these things. Okay. I mean, I could level up my catches level nine. But do I want to crown Layla though? That's the thing. Oh no, my more my more is actually getting a little bit low. I might just run out more first. Okay, I'll level up my skills a little bit as well. Wait, actually, let me just ascend Layla. Not Layla, Dory as well, real quick. Hopefully, I'm not doing some kind of Genshin taboo. But, wait, I actually don't have enough materials. <laughs> well, but my goal for now is to level up all my characters to level 90. Talent-wise, it could be maybe a little bit... I don't even know, I could wait. But, once I do so, I'll be... Tackling the abyss and see how far I can get through. After raising all my characters. Minus Jin though. I'm not raising Jin because um I got I didn't really want to get her, but don't tell anybody else. Okay, Dory, wait, can oh okay, I need to craft five of those gemstones and then I'll be able to level Dory as well. Oh, perfect. So level 90 Dory as well. Oh, level 90 as well for Dory. Okay. Who else needs to get to level 90? Uh Amber maybe? Wait, I actually don't have enough. Materials for Amber, okay. Amber needs 390. I mean, right now I'm also leveling up my Amber as well, so I want Amber to be my party, so... But honestly, I don't know which part is more painful. Farming for the Aramite stuff, or farming the Henna Berries. Both are probably equally painful. I mean, it's not like they're annoying, because they're already, like, they're scattered everywhere. But if they're more generous, like the Treasure Hoarders, then I'll be gladly fighting them. Because I know Treasure Hoarders are one of the most generous enemies. Even though they're, like, hoarding, um, treasure, I guess. Despite the name. They're still pretty generous. They still drop a lot of things. Okay, I'm just gonna finish up Amber Ascension. After this boss, I should be able to ascend her. What? Alright. I got three, even though I don't need three. Sure. But yeah, all characters are level 90 now, right? Besides Amber, let me see if I can ascend her yet. Nope, I need... Okay, I'll collect 10 of these real quick. How do you get characters from polling? Events. Jin, I did pull a standard banner. Not standard banner, but a beginner banner, but like... I didn't want her, technically. So she stays at level 1 for now. Okay. I can ascend Amber as well now. Everyone besides Farozan is level 90. I don't even know how many characters are level up to level 90 now. I think last one is Farozan, actually. Okay. There we go. So, Amber is level 90 now, right? Let me check. Level 90? I don't know why, but like, everyone has an extra show next to their name. I don't know why. Ah! <sighs> ah! Uh, uh, can my phone just be level 80? I don't know. I never farm these things. Use the net for exploring. I mean, I'd rather just bunny hop. I think it's faster that way. Lene isn't really like yelling where she's fast or something. I mean, if we have a camel to ride on, then I would like it. Or like the Sumter Beast. I wish we have our own Sumter Beast and they can, you can use them as a mount. Cause you see how fast they go? Like... They give you a nice boost. But if you can ride them, it'll be way better. But that's what Genshin missed. They should've gave us like a Sumter Beast or something. I will finish however long the world quest is to get one for free. And be able to ride it in the desert. Let me see if I can craft the enemy drops to ascend my flowers on though. Okay, let's just see if I can actually ascend my flowers on yet. 11? Okay. Is that enough? I don't even know. Hit me AR rewards? I know, I know. Okay, 79 now. Cool. But yeah, my characters are all pretty much leveled besides G now. Everybody's level 90. Uh, so what I'm doing now is... Since Noel, I need to level her up still. Or like, I guess build her. I'm gonna farm the resistance domain. Well, I actually don't have the violence claw. But yeah. Need more of these resistance stuff. Nope. Alright, can I get a gold for last one? Ooh, two of them. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, let me see if I can level my talent for Noel now. Oh. <laughs> so we already built Farozan up to level 79, but I do need a little bit of these henna berries, so I'll probably be farming that a little bit more. And there are some artifacts and talents I could farm now, so let's go to battle today. The Valen's Claw. I mean, you could fight the Valen. I don't have any, like, bow characters, though. That's the thing. I'm just waiting for the Valen to come down. So, alright, come down. Yeah. He's not gonna fly away yet, so... I'll just wait until it comes down, drop down. Yeah, bow down to me. 
Thank you. And then, after I get rid of a shield, what should I do? Just beat it. That's it. Pretty easy boss. Yeah, I'm using Kaya National. Pretty broken team. But Devon doesn't really have that much HP. Like, this is the hardest difficulty, and it just dropped dead, see? Bye. Hope you have a nice time, I guess, down there, wherever you are. The Volans cause, that's actually what I'm looking for. So now I'm able to hopefully triple crown like Lisa. Okay, I actually can't triple crown her yet, but I do have two of these now. So let me see. I think first is more important. Yeah. Wait, actually it's E. So I guess I'll listen to the talent upgrade priority and just crown my Lisa's as elemental skill in. Sure. First. I might need to farm a little bit more, but I do only have 7 crowns though, as well. Okay, let me check. Layla can craft 10%. Okay, give me some 10%ers. Okay, I didn't get any 10%ers, but... Still. The ballot is today's is domain, so I could be farming a little bit. Okay, 20%. It kind of made up for not winning the 10% just now. And how do I do this again? As someone that don't really build my characters that much, I don't really know if you could, how to convert this. Like this? Okay, pretty easy, I guess. I need four of them, so I can triple crown her. Wait, actually, do I even need four? Oops. I might have not been able to read since I think I made a mistake. Okay, right, but let me double check, though. Okay, I only need one, so I need seven of the slimes. All right, let me just go find some slimes. Slime is not really an enemy I farm that much, but I go out my way to farm, so I don't really know. Something about just killing these slimes together is very satisfying. I don't know why. Oh, I got a blue. Okay, I got another blue. Wait, does that mean I'm able to triple crown Lisa now? I really got lucky. Okay, never mind. I was way off. I don't know. To be honest, I don't really like to farm the slimes because I'd rather just passively get the drops. And since they're everywhere, I shouldn't be even farming these things. But I guess when I build my characters, I'll run out. So after farming the slimes, I only need two more of these. But I'm too lazy to go farm for two more, so I'm just gonna go craft them. And we'll finally get our triple crown Lisa. Okay. But I need triple crown Lisa now. So I think Lisa is done. I have my weapon ready. She's triple crowned. She has 941 elemental mastery. And a quote, no wish account with an asterisk on. I think it's pretty good. I think Dory is in a good spot now. Layla, I don't know if I want a razor. Talents, I mean. I kinda wanna farm artifacts. Oh yeah, I got a re I think my other goal was raise Kale. I kinda wanna triple crown her as well. But in order to do so, I need to farm the Praxis. Luckily, the Praxis domain is today. Okay, my Farmer's is also level 80 as well, so that's good. I think I'm just gonna use this comp. Like, towards the end, when I'm done building everyone, but I'm already technically done building everyone to level 90, just Farmer's on now. But like, the thing is though, I'll try to use all of these characters in the Abyss and see what happens. As I'm done, I guess, almost crowning Kale, I'll just uh, farm artifacts. Let's see how far we can take Kali now. Now that we farm a little bit of the talents. I probably need a little bit more of these um bows, I guess, or arrows, I guess. I'm hoping I can take Kali to like at least level 8 talents, maybe. 177 right now, currently, I think. Yeah. But I could probably craft a little bit more of the Praxis artifacts with talents. Okay. Uh, level 8 now. When we check the talent references. So people level up burst more and then the uh, skill. Okay. At least level 9, right? It's good. Maybe 199 should be good enough. Yeah. I can only level to 9 since I don't have a lot of things. Okay, level 9 now. I think this is fine. Should definitely be a good asset to the team. Oh. Okay. I might need to farm that. And also some rune guards. Let me just check and see though if I have enough to craft. Oh, never mind. I don't even need to farm these. I don't know why I have so many of these just stocked up or something. So I guess I have these, but I need to farm rune guards a little bit, I guess. So I'll go to the island with, with four rune guards, I guess, and then hopefully we get some good drops. Ah, 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 no, no, I'm not ready. Oh, oh, no, no. Okay, got one purple. Hmm, how much do I need for this? Seven more, okay. I can probably just craft them. Yep, I'll just craft ten, I guess. All right, Kali's weapon finally max ascended as well. But yeah. My other characters are, I guess, pretty much ready for everything, right? Maybe I'll do this. I'm actually running out of Mora. I only have like 500k now. How do I even get more? I don't know. I'm poor now. Is this what it means to actually raise your characters? Like, I literally don't have any money anymore. 
I mean, I could farm more, like, ley lines, but, like, I don't really want to run around. Okay, how sad is this? I'm farming f the ley line for Mora. I don't usually do this, by the way. I'm just very desperate now, because I don't have Mora anymore. And I probably need them for, like, farming artifacts as well in the future. I'm desperate, alright? No, I use... Wait, did I use condensed or did I use... I don't even know. Okay. So we get 120k, apparently. Wow. Oh, hello. I'm still, like, trying to farm Moira right now. After this, I'll go into Artifact Domain, so... I don't know what Artifact Domain you guys wanted to see. Like, I might just farm Deep Wood or something as well. Maybe? Okay, so... Uh, did a bit of farming. I can finally ascend. Uh, just kidding. I lied. Any gemstones? Need three more of these. Or a few more of these. Whatever. I can ascend flowers now, now finally. As for the fields and puzzles that remain to be studied and explored. Very wise words, Farozan. Okay, so now my Farozan is level 89 now. So, ooh. My weapon is kind of bad though. I don't have anything good. <laughs> I can't pull on this account, so this is the only thing I got. Did I level up Messenger? I mean, maybe I could. But yeah. No! <laughs> What's your strong box? I have so many artifacts that I think I'm going to strong box a few like, artifacts for now. Like, all of my characters that you guys see right now, like the characters, which I will benefit more. Mine... But now I already have a pretty good noblest piece, I think. Look at this feather. I, I died a little bit inside after rolling this. Like, why isn't this on my main? But yeah. And what about the sands? I have 103 and <laughs> 102 mastery. Why can't I be on a flower or something? But out of all the characters, which one? Which, like, artifact says should I strongbox? Emblem? I mean, this account is pretty RNG carried artifact wise. I get all my artifacts are pretty good. Okay, I'll just strongbox the emblem for now a little bit, I guess. Since I don't think I need to improve my tenacity as much. Eh. No double. Oh. 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 Why does this have to be a goblet? I want hand assisting for so, because that's double max stats. So. Don't give me a defense. Give me like EM or something. Or attack percent, maybe. Okay. It's over. It's over. Parade? Okay. Okay. Energy recharge, not bad. Please? Why? Do I use this to feed my other artifact with double crit? Yes or no? I might just unlock this and rage. Okay, and that's just okay. Maybe not. I got crit damage. Let me compare this to my other artifacts. Okay, I'm running out more again. <laughs> okay, so I mean it's better for Farozan, right? It might actually be better for my Xiangling as well. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I think it's actually good. Okay, Xiangling can use this actually. But maybe Xiangling's artifact can be used as a fodder. There's no energy recharge, so I better see crit damage lines. And will maybe crit rate. Thank you. Okay, plus eighteen. Plus 90. Oh, I mean, this sounds good. Oh, plus 20. Okay. Please, just give me double crit. I'm spending half of my more. I'm I'm broke after this. Okay, that's kind of trash. Three crit roll. Not so bad. And then below 30% crit damage is bad to me. Okay, I got another one though. I can roll another one. This one. This one has a very low rolls. So I'm expecting 20% crit rate on this. This one be, might be my Shincho artifact. I don't even know. We'll see. Okay. I said 16% crit rate, but still, it can still get to 16% crit rate. So I was... No, I'm, I'm broke again! Is there any quick money making methods I could do? Okay, let's get a crit rate, and then we'll get 16% crit rate. Ooh, okay. So what's this good for? Let me check my colleague though. I don't know if she needs improvement. I think she might need some improvement, yeah. I need to focus on building Kale next. So most of my characters are level 90 now on this no pull account. My artifacts are like okay, I think. This is my flower. I don't know if I should be using this flower. <laughs> uh I think my flower is my off piece actually. Like my feather? Look at this feather. And then the sands is decent. Goblet is geo damage goblet, and it's on piece, so why not, right? Circlet is also on piece. That's a little bit of defense lines. But I think my flower is probably the weakest, actually. Like, is there a way to get better flower? 
I'll probably like strong box more artifacts later and then we can sort of see if we can find anything good. You guys told me not to do this, but okay, see, this one's already pretty decent. This one, maybe? I don't know. I think my flower was pretty bad, so I could get like a better flower, definitely. Okay. So far, no double crits yet. Oh, okay. Um, well then. I'll plus 19 first, I guess. So it'll be more, I guess, exciting that way. You can see if I'm very close to getting 30 CV or not. Okay, fingers crossed. Ah, uh, no chance. Bad, 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 trash, bad, garbage. Let's see the 40% crit damage, and then it'll be worth it, right? Let's get 40% crit damage, and then make my Noel very strong. Huh? I mean, I know Noel needs defense, but like, not that much, right? So the main reason why I also started this account is to build Amber, because I've always wanted to build her and didn't really get a chance to, so on this account, she definitely has her chance to shine. I do have all of these artifacts, but I do want a four-piece wonders trope, but I also don't really want to replace this artifact, so I'm not really sure what I should do. Maybe I'll go strongbox some wonders trope artifact and see if I can get anything good. Please give me something good. Okay, I'll have my trash. Oh, feather, feather, good. Oh, another feather, that's good. Two for two, three for three, four for four. Okay, I would say this is pretty decent, but I'm not gonna unlock it. What? Okay, this was like a very good strong boxing session. Maybe you should like the video to get my luck. I'll send you my luck your way if you like the video. So we got a pretty decent haul. So now let's upgrade it. Okay, this flower is pretty meh. So let's see if we can actually improve our flower. Okay, plus 9. This will determine whether or not this is worth upgrading. Uh... Well, I guess it's good for Noel. I may be doing something unforgivable. I'm using less crit damage and crit rate feather to trade for this other flower. So please, with all my sacrifice, give me something good. I would like to see a 40 CV piece. And also to sacrifice all these purple ones. I don't really care. But this might come back to bite me. Oh, two times? Okay. Lesson learned. We shouldn't be doing that. Do I dare? Yes, I dare. But I'm looking at one line, which is this defense line. And if it gets more than one defense line again upgrade, I'll be really upset. So yeah. Just give me all crit damage and then... Uh, We'll be best friends again with his artifact. You know what? I'll take it. But like, there's no crit damage, so this is unusable already. That wasn't my best artifact upgrading session, so I'll stop. Okay, so I apologize in advance to all of you people that are triggered by my exclamation mark on all my characters. I feel like it's probably time to test out everyone against multiple bosses and just see how we fare against all the enemies in Tevat. So this Hyper Boom team has been carrying my account for the longest time, so I feel like I'm pretty much ready for- Okay, I'm going home. Bye. So as I was saying, this Hyper Boom team has been carrying my account for the longest time, because all four characters are basically free to play. I get Barbara pretty early on in the game, Lisa is a starter character, and Digital Traveler you can just get if you go to Sumeru. So just see how much damage you can do. 30k? Not bad. 33? Oh. Yeah, he dust. He deserved it. Okay, so... Uh, wait, what's this blue fire thing? Okay, that's kind of creepy. But, as I was saying, this second team I'm bringing to fight Maku Genki is my second favorite team. It also might be my second Abyss team as well. It combines a lot of Vaporize and also some occasional melts if my Kaya has his burst up. But... My guy also uses his physical attacks to like, just slash pretty good damage, like around 4k and around 12k. So yeah, his Mount King is basically dead. Boba? Eh. Easy. What? You're dead already! Just stay dead! Boba is better than Mount Kenki confirmed. I'm actually gonna fight a pretty hard boss, but I'm just curious on how much damage the Amber can be doing. 5,000. Uh, okay. I'm overloading as well, so I'm doing a good amount of damage. Alright, Bear and Bunny, do something. Oh, hello? But I'm gonna try and kill this boss with Bear and Bunny. I don't know if it's possible. Do it? No? 
Come on, come on. Seriously. Don't die. No, I told you to not die, but you died. All right, it's time for Abyss. Row 9, I'm pretty sure it's pretty easy. The like, enemies are like just little trolls. I do mimics, yeah? Seems like a pretty easy floor. Hello? Okay. So, uh, I brought a team of Amber, so... Yeah. I also have my Layla shield as well with me, so I don't have to worry about just charge attacking and randomly getting booped from behind or anything. See, my shield is actually pretty strong. Still have it. Even this treasure holder can't do anything to me. Oh! Okay, so... Layla's shield kind of disappears very fast, so... I gotta get used to it still. I call this team the Master Taunter team. Because we do have Lenette's burst that can also taunt. In addition to our Baron Bunny. I don't even know where to aim at this robot. Like, do we aim at an egg sack? I think so. I got I got a pretty good damage on that. So my second team is my Noel team. Yeah, nice try. I'm still not really used to these new Fontaine enemies. Like, I don't even know. They look like some kind of sea hedgehogs or something. I mean, they look kind of cute. Normally when I'm on other accounts, I just beat them up really quick, so I didn't really get a chance to look at them and admire their beauty. Okay, Noel, let's see how good you can be. Like Noel said, we'll just clean up these enemies like trash. Okay, that was easy. Okay, this should be able to finish the enemies off. Yep. Oh yeah, I don't even know what team I'm using. This team is like scuffed super conduct, I guess. Second team, I just kind of put it all together as well. This tractor is so annoying. That has pretty good, like, design. I like the balls on the ground that's rolling around with as a tire. Oh, I broke. So many different elements. I'm hoping I'm swirling the correct ones. Hello. Teach me your workout routine. How do you get these arms? Well, this chamber is a little bit difficult, so I'm hoping that I'm able to get three stars. Just gotta protect our- Oh, wait, 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 what are you guys looking at? Hello, hello? Look at me! Please don't hit it! No, no. And this is like a burn gen slash hyper bloom team that I just enjoy using, so... Hopefully, I can clear floor 11 with three stars because of this. What kind of growth potion do you take to get that tall? Oh, you gonna talk? That's fine. That was easy. These are the times where I hope I have a sucrose, but like, Genshin never gave us a free sucrose, so I can't use her. I think this chamber has three enemies, and they all spawn one at a time, so it's kind of annoying. But we do have like around two minutes to deal with them, so it's hoping that it'll be smooth. Hopefully this team can actually survive the third chamber though. I know third chamber is notoriously difficult for a lot of people. Okay, since I have like over a minute and a half left, I don't think I should hurry and just unleash my burst. I should just save my burst for the final chamber. Now for my ultimate test. These slimes are like, I don't know, not really that hard to deal with, but I only have like two minutes to fight them. So at the same time, it's a little bit scary because I might run out of time. These enemies like to waste time as well. Now, I don't know what happened. I just got exploded out of nowhere. So thank you, uh, Genshin. Was well, it only two enemies here? I don't even know. Wait, there's two. So first, let's just get them all together. Now, I'll just try to hyper bloom them. Okay, let's not die. Let's not die. If we die, then it'll be very bad. Okay, time to unleash my Xiangling's burst. Reason why I did that is because I didn't really want to like interrupt my reactions, but so far it's actually looking pretty good. Okay, stop farting on me, thank you. Lisa needs to like just help me. Now it's gotta like reset, hopefully. Get my burst back up. Come on. No! I thought I could do this in one try. Okay. Oh, please. Please, no. You know what? I don't care anymore. 50 primo gems isn't as important as my sanity. So floor 12, I'm just hoping that I'm able to get at least 50 primo gems out of it. And use this as a learning experience. Okay, I got one star. 
Now I just need one more star on each of my chambers, and then I'm good. These things. That was a pain. Especially that tractor thing. Why is it in floor 12 as well? Why is it in floor 12 as well? Okay, at least this is the first half. Well, let's hope my team can stay alive and not just get sent right back to chamber one. Oh no, it's this boss. Okay, I gotta play very, very extra carefully. <sighs> I knew that would happen. Even though we didn't really get to complete Abyss as a whole, I feel like we came a long way. And since Abyss is resetting soon in like one hour, I'm gonna just take out my Pinball Gems. So, after building all my characters, there are some characters that I'm not really satisfied with, like, after everything is said and done. Like, my Traveler is still using a level 60 Sapwood Blade. That's definitely something I need to improve. And her artifacts and talents, especially, aren't really that good as well. Like, 177, no constellations at all. So I definitely need to improve this. And I probably need to farm a little bit more of these Deepwood sets. I only have 46 of them. So... I feel like I need to do like a part two or something that is finished building all my characters here. So my Traveler is definitely someone like a character that needs the most improvement. Another character is Kale. Like she's almost maxed. Yeah. But the thing that still irks me is her artifacts. Like my artifacts aren't really that good. I mean, as I said that, I got a 16% crit rate flower right here, but like still. I kind of want a deep wood 4-piece or whatever she uses. Like my digital server already have 4-piece deep wood, but like... I'm not sure what other artifacts I could use on her. Go to Dreams, maybe? With a flower as an off-piece? And my plans on this account after... Like, I literally have 100k Primo Gems. So, I'll be trying to go for C6 Farina. Hopefully, and maybe her weapon if I have enough 50-50 wins. And after I get Farina after pulling the 100k Primo Gems... I'll try to build her as well, and then go back and tackle uh, this. Other than building Farina in part 2 of this video, you guys should comment who I should build as well. Like, I'll listen to your suggestions as well. Besides, like, Traveler and Kali, like, I'm gonna build for sure. But other than that, every characters are pretty nice.